Hello friends, Tony here. In this video, I'm going to talk about uh, Etertia and Livewire, which is uh, not better, but I think more uh, powerful, we can say, if we can say something like this. And here I am in the Laravel website. So the PHP framework for web artisans. Okay. If we scroll down, we can see one framework, many flavors. So build a robust full stack applications in PHP using Laravel and Livewire. So you can build full stack application only with PHP if you choose Livewire. But if you love uh, JavaScript, you can build a monolithic React or Vue driver front end by pairing Laravel with Inertia. Or let Laravel serves as, serve as a robust backend API for your next JS or any uh, front end framework. And I have opened here the Livewire and also the Inertia. So Livewire, the most productive way to build your next web application, powerful dynamic front-end UIs without leaving the PHP. So you can build the front-end UIs, uh, not with PHP, but with PHP and uh, Blade and HCML. Okay. Now, if I open the Inertia, so build single page apps without building an API. So you don't need to build an API because in uh, most cases, when you build a uh, full stack application, we have the backend. So for example, Laravel as a backend serves as a backend and the frontend two separate projects. Laravel framework as a backend and for example, the React or Vue project as a frontend. But with Inertia, you can build single page application without building an API because inertia is a layer between Laravel and the front-end uh, framework like uh, React, Vue, or Svelte. So create modern single-page React, Vue, and Svelte app using Classic server-side routing. So it works with any backend. It's not only for Laravel, but it's tuned for Laravel. Okay, then of course I have opened the React uh, website so in the library for web and native user interfaces the same is also the Vue.js for the beauty web user interfaces and also we have open here i have opened here the alpine.js your new lightweight javascript framework is uh, new is okay lightweight yeah but i think it's not uh, as powerful as the uh, React and you, this is my opinion, but yeah, it's, it's powerful, but not as React and Vue. With React, you can create your own uh, application, also the same with Vue.js. And React has a Next.js framework, it's uh, very popular, and also Vue has the Nuxt. Okay, now here I have created this uh, diagram for Laravel to choose Livewire or Inertia. If we choose Livewire, because we work with Laravel, I assume you have the knowledge about Laravel. So if you know Laravel, Livewire is the same as Laravel, so it's very easy to learn. So it doesn't need too much work. And with Livewire, you don't need other framework to build full stack application. You are ready to go. You can build your full stack application only with Laravel and Livewire, so you don't need to learn too much things. With Inertia, on the other hand, it's easy to learn. Yeah, it's easy to learn. It's not very hard, but we need another framework, for example, React, Svelte, or Vue.js. So we need the front end framework to work within one shell and Laravel. But is React, uh, Svelte, or Vue.js? Is it to learn or not? In my case, in my opinion, is easy to learn React, Svelte, or Vue.js if you have uh, uh, JavaScript knowledge. So you need JavaScript knowledge to learn React. And if you have knowledge about JavaScript, I think it's very easy to learn also React, Svelte, or Vue.js. I think React maybe is a little bit harder, but Vue.js and Svelte is very easy to learn. Now, if you want more powerful uh, UI, I think if you use Livewire, you need also the Alpine JS. 
which is easy to learn Alpages, but all Alpages React Vault and UGS is all about the creating the user interface more uh, dynamic, uh, more cool, beautiful, and so on. And with Alpages, you may not have uh, too much uh, many pre UI components if you search on the internet. The opposite is with the React Vault and UGS. So with React, you have uh, too many free UI components. Also with VGS, I think have we have many UI components. And with the Svelte, you can find some components built in. So you don't need to go and build yourself. And of course, uh, React, Svelte and VGS, with React Svelte and VGS, I think we have more power on the front end. Okay, and this is what I wanted to talk about uh, in this video. So Livewire versus Inertia. If you choose Livewire with Laravel, it's easy to learn and you don't, don't need uh, other frameworks. But of course, you could choose Alpine also with Livewire, which is easy to learn and you can build more user interfaces, more beautiful, more dynamic and so on. It's okay. If you want to choose Inertia, it's... Uh, you, it's easy to learn, but you need other framework like React, Svelte, or Vue.js, which are easy to learn if you need, if you know uh, JavaScript. And with React, Svelte, and Vue.js, you have some free components if you search on the, on the internet, and you have more power on the front end. And of course, if you ha have knowledge about React, Svelte, and Vue, you are more able to find a job in the developer community okay friends that's it in this video if you like such a video so don't forget to subscribe to my channel like the video share with your friends and see you in the next one all the best thank you very much